let's go. So I am Julien Pivoto. I work for, um, uh, for Inuit. Uh, we are a Belgium-based company doing lots of open source. And Vox Populi uh, is just uh, a community project made by uh, people that use Puppet. Uh, but I think that this story is also uh, useful for people who use uh, other config management tools because it solves problems that can happen to basically any project, and especially Puppet, because there you have just uh, lots of modules and lots, lo lots of people work hard in their module, and they make the more beautiful module. They open source it on GitHub, and it works very, very well, and they get like, lots of pull requests, releases, and until the day they stop working on that project because they switch job or they switch project or they don't have the money anymore to do that, or any reason in life that happens that, yeah, basically the project start just becoming dead, uh, and then uh, no one can um, accept the pull request uh, because the project was centralized on one people namespace, uh, so people just find bugs, fix bugs, make the project evolve, but no one can just accept them. Then you uh, also have more and more forks, forks, and you don't know which one is the good one you need to use. Which project should I use? There are like three active forks, uh, all going to different direction. What should I do? Where should I open my pre Because it's really becoming uh, crazy uh, because the original maintainer is not there. Uh, in the Puppet world, we also rely a lot on, on Ruby and managing just uh, Travis CI of the jobs means a lot of work. It's almost a full-time job just making sure that uh, all the Travis games are compatible with each other, so it's really, really hard. For that, we created in the Puppet community uh, a Vox Populi project, which was initially named uh, Puppet Community, but we renamed to avoid train mark issues in the future. So basically, it's for Puppet modules, it's for uh, Puppet related stuff. Uh, it's a community, so it's not uh, an enterprise, it's not uh, money driven, it's just people. We just want to work together. So we are uh, testers, developers, ops people, all kind of uh, people that just have the same uh, interest in Puppet and in uh, Puppet modules that work and that they can use, reuse. So we work together as one team uh, around all of those uh, projects. So we welcome all the modules, uh, sometimes in a very bad shape, sometimes in a good shape, just people step down from projects. And then we take all of those modules into one namespace. And basically what we do then is that uh, we fix uh, the modules, uh, we make them evolve, we we make new releases. Uh, we take care of the Travis CI stuff. So basically, all those modules that would have been abandoned, now they have one home, uh, which is Vox Populi. Uh, we also uh, keep CI green on all the modules. So we know that if you open a pull request and the CI is red, you know that it's because it's not because the project has not been updated for two months, but it's because really there is a problem in your code. So. And we do that over time. So even if you don't commit to uh, a project in one month, then you will still get uh, those updates from the CI and all that stuff. So we'll always ensure that the projects are, are fine and they are still uh, in a good shape. So it's not like we only uh, put that one day and we update it every X time. No, we do that frequently. So it means that humans are not the bottlenecks because lots of people have the right uh, to commit to commit uh, to the repositories to accept the pull request. We just share the responsibilities between all of us, so it's not like one guy per uh, repository anymore. That's not the way it works. Uh, you just have any anyone that does puppet and that have interest in a module can just uh, step in and just start accepting pull requests. We do that by doing a lot of automation, like maintaining the game files, maintaining the respect files. All of that is automated thanks to uh, third party projects. Everything is uh, open source, of course, even the automation tooling, but that's all we do. We also have a code of conduct, so in the community, everyone feels secure, and it's very important for us that we welcome everyone uh, into that community. We are now 80 people, uh, so it's quite big and it's very, very active. So. Just join us, give us our modules like gifts. We will be very happy to welcome them, and yeah, that way your pro your project will live longer than your job. So just join us. Uh, it will be fun. We just have fun together. You can read more at voxpopuli.org. Thank you.